Mikhail Chesnikov. Chesnikov was a Russian composer who lived in the tumultuous time between the uh, Russian Revolution and then the start of the Soviet Union, died in 1944. And uh, he was uh, very gifted as a choral conductor and wrote over 500 choral compositions. And, um, um, and 400 of them are sacred in nature, Christian uh, hymns and etc. And uh, he actually founded the choral conducting program at the uh, Moscow Conservatory. Um, however, uh, this uh, Salvation is Created, which was 1912-12, and it was the fifth of his ten communion hymns, and it's one of his best known works, and one of the last sacred works he composed because the Soviet Union um, did not allow uh, people to create sacred artworks. And the original text is salvation is made in the midst of the earth, O God, alleluia. And this is a um, band uh, arrangement that's uh, arranged by Michael Brown. Riding off to his destiny, 
contrasted by a lyrical slow section, followed by the return of the opening material and a heroic coda. Uh, Sweeney is a director of band publications for Hal Leonard, which is one of the largest publisher in the world, and he has extensive experience as a band director with concert, jazz, and marching programs from elementary to high school, and contributes as a composer and arranger in all instrumental areas. And I think this is an appropriate time to introduce our knights in armor, the music educators in our band. It's really uh, wonderful to have uh, professional musicians and educators join our concert band. Uh, we have um, three music majors in the band currently, Lidikoi, Kyle, and Ashley, and, and um, And please spread the word that the, uh, the music is well at Yuba College, and we have a lot of different kinds of offerings for students. And, uh, and I also want to ask uh, all the educators in the group to stand up so that we can acknowledge the hard work you do. You know, uh, trying to teach music through the pandemic was a very difficult uh, thing, right, everybody? Uh, you know, it, it, it's hard to make music over Zoom, and uh, everybody here has worked so hard to make it happen to, you know, uh, children and high schoolers and college kids, so we really appreciate your hard work, and you are the heroes of the night, and so enjoy the Knights of Destiny.
Christmas theme to 1960s chamber music group, New York Rock and Roll Ensemble. And he became successful and prolific film composer with scores to the Die Hard Trilogy, X-Men, Lethal Weapon, Mr. Boland's Opus, and more than 70 others. And this quartet was commissioned by Cayman's Juliet schoolmate and former Canadian brass trumpeter, Ronald Ron. The Canadian brass has performed this emotionally moving piece often, recorded on the CD, Amazing Brass, and produced a film performance uh, as well. Here is the moving quintet.
Beautiful. Um, I want to introduce Dr. Alan Miller, who is a, a former band director and who keeps coming back from out of his retirement for us to teach classes and then to even play in the band. So Dr. Miller. And our staff accompanist Milena Mileva, who is usually a pianist, but today he, she is playing, helping out with the percussion section. And Jen Aldrich, who teaches woodwind and applied music for us. And Cookie Molina, who is going to be leading a jazz band in just a few minutes. Uh, I also wanted to thank Matthew Grasso, who is our guitar and theory composition faculty, who is doing a recording tonight. And Joe Stockman and Elsie Prater for, uh, for uh, running the, uh, the, all of the theater stuff and setting up for us. Thank you. You know, it, it takes a lot of the, uh, the team to really move a lot of things and we, are really, uh, we really appreciate everybody's effort to make concerts happen. Speaking of concerts, we have more uh, department events coming up. Uh, on November 9th, that's uh, one week from Tuesday, this coming Tuesday, one week from Tuesday, we have Tuesday noon recital in this space and showcasing a lot of our students, current students. Uh, we'll have some uh, guitarists, guitar ensemble, um, pianists, uh, maybe singers, um, and I'm not sure if anybody else is playing, but the, uh, it'll be a great one hour concert at noon, uh, noon to one o'clock here in the uh, theater. Also on the Friday, December 3rd at 7.30, the, uh, the symphonic band and the jazz band will be performing the winter instrumental concert. Um, and then week after that, Friday, the December 10th, is a music department concert with concert choir, string ensemble, guitar ensemble, and another soloist. Um, after the Celtic air and dance, uh, we'll take a few minutes to reset for the jazz band. And so I hope you all stick around for the fabulous jazz band. Um, Celtic air and dance by Michael Sweeney, who was the composer of the, uh, the Night of Destiny. He arranged the, um, the traditional Celtic folk songs. And this is the uh, Scottish the potting glass and the Gaelic thummy sigis. And potting glass um, is the final hospitality offered to departing guests to fortify them through the, their journey. The song is often sung at the end of a gathering of friends, and this is kind of rather appropriate that they are ending this cons uh, this portion of the concert tonight. So feel to me the potting glass and drink a health whatever befalls. Good night and joy be to you all. I'm sorry, I can't do Scottish accents. <laughs> <laughs> and then, Hami Sigif is a fairy's love song, and the fairy who sings, I am tired and I am alone, cutting the bracken forever. He falls in love with a, a, a beautiful girl, a human girl, and um, uh, it doesn't go too well. The, the, the girl's family finds out and locks her up in the house. But Sweeney's arrangement of this song is up-tempo with driving rhythmic energy. So I hope you enjoy the symphonic band and stick around for the jazz band afterwards. Wow. Mm -hmm. 